the planet is. That's what we're going to find out. Brendan, it's me. Pop, what are you doing here? Tommy's back. Did he say if he wants to see me? I'm proud of you, Tommy. What you did for that kid, the tank. What was I supposed to do, let him drown? Tommy Reardon, you saved my life. Look, Brendan, the bank has got to go by the new appraisal figures. You're upside down on your mortgage. How much do you need? I didn't come in for long, Frank. I was hoping that you would train me. Are you serious? Do it! I thought we agreed that we weren't going to raise our children in a family where their father gets beat up for a living. Brendan, you're a teacher. You got no business in the ring with those animals. Actually, I used to be one of those animals. I guess I forgot to put that down on my application. There's this big tournament. Top 16 middleweights in the world. But when it takes all, I'm gonna need a trainer. Not that much you were good at. Frank, I need this. I got a family to protect. Everything I do is for them. What's going on up here? Daddy is now a princess. Mom needed you. I needed you. You're my big brother. You bailed on me. I was a 16-year-old kid. What the hell did I know? You had a choice, okay? You had a choice. War hero Tommy Reardon, who has become an overnight sensation, and Brandon Conlon, the physics teacher, they pulled off a miracle. You can do this. What are you saying? I can do this. to win this fight now, because if we're not, I'll have a throw in the towel. Winner by tip out, Kenny's Walker. You look good out there. Brody James, what are you doing in Beaumont, Texas? Why'd you walk away from the game? I just didn't want it anymore. Time's running out, Case. I just signed with Primordial Combat. They're a freak show. A bunch of roided up fighters with damn near no rules. You gotta come with me, Case. Help me train for this fight. In Thailand? Every day you're scuttling around here in the boonies is another day that you're not on top. PFC is proud to announce a title fight between these two titans of MMA. Who the hell are you? I'm the guy Brody asked to fly halfway around the world to help him train for this fight. New school versus the old school. I've been having this vision. I've been having this vision. Breaking out of these walls. a disruptive presence to the camp. He was unstoppable. He was, what's it, his way or no way? I can't do business or something like that. Light him up, light him up. What light about all that karate code of honor you're always talking about? Light him, light him James is out light after him, suffering a knee injury in training. This fight's gonna happen. Who's fighting Braga? You are. Come on, old school, let's do this. I gotta do what I gotta do. That's for my face, back in my face. I gotta do what I gotta do. I pray to God, he never came. You wanted a shot? That's your shot. Oh, hey, Principal Betcher. You're late. Again. Oh, man, I was teacher of the year. That was 10 years ago. Feels like eight, though, right? As several of you already know, Wilkinson High School has been operating at a budget deficit. We are cutting all extracurricular activities. Excuse me? Everyone's quit on these kids. We have to cut $48,000. Or raise the money. Oh, and who's gonna do that? We will. So what exactly is the plan? How about we work out a plan in my apartment and dinner also happens to be around, so we just do both. Not a chance. I gotta figure this thing out. We live right after we watch the fight. It's hard to believe he got 10 grand for that performance. He made 10 grand for that fight? But he lost. Hey, if he won, it would have been 50. I wanna fight mixed martial arts. This is crazy. Do you even know how to do that? No. No, I do not. But I was a really good wrestler in college. I think I can do this. Let's see what you got. Right, which guy am I fighting? Both. Come on, I can't fight two guys. I can't train a 42-year-old biology teacher. 
You want to be a fighter? Start in the cage. Is that a chicken? This is bottom level MMA. You're going to follow in the footsteps of all those great warriors that put fear in the hearts of their opponents. You dislocated your shoulder. You gotta help me. You ready? I always wanted to try this. Try this? What do you mean try? You never done this? Don't you know what? You're not cutting anything. That's the first installment right there. You're getting beat up in your bathing suit. You are embarrassing this school. This wasn't plan A, but I don't know what else to do. If you don't make an effort, nothing's ever gonna change. Inspiring your students, I see. All right, everybody, let's get our story straight. Uh, Derek did it. <laughs> What are you teaching these kids if you go through with it? What am I teaching them if I don't? I don't think I'm gonna be able to do this. You can quit right now. And everything we worked for will have been accomplished. Our students, they're inspired. When I was 12 years old, I watched my parents die. <gasps> A man walked up to our car, waving his gun in my father's face. They shot him. He never saw me. But I saw him. According to this, you're barely passing, and you haven't even started your community service hours. You can't take a third victim of that, son. Your grandfather and I have a possible solution. Your father's old friend, Reggie, runs that dojo. This is the main dojo floor. The only time you'll be on it is when you're cleaning it. So I'm your janitor. You're here because you made the wrong choices. I'm Jen. Michael, you're uh, Reggie's niece, right? I'm going to show you something. Fighting. Your champion, Dominic. inside this cage. No weight class. Or a fight. And get out of my office. I'm not training you so you can go out and fight in some circus. Yeah! I killed my parents. I have my chance at it. Chance to do it what? You want to know something funny? I can kill you. And nobody would care. <laughs> now there's these guys I want you to meet. Go, sprawl! They'll be able to help you with your ground game. This is the tournament of all tournaments. I know you think that you need to do this. I don't care how big this guy is. I don't care how mean he is. I don't care about his reputation. What you can do for them. All right? Right. We got a real David versus Goliath here tonight, baby! Great fight. I don't know why everybody's not coming to this fight. Pay-per-view's pulling back on the promotion. We're not selling tickets. We have a deal or we don't have a deal. We need a gimmick. What good's a deal if nobody's making any money? Time up. Think he has a handicap? No. The other guy has a handicap if he cannot control himself. Breathe. You know the escape. Breathe. There's always an escape. Your check bounced. My check? The martial arts supply. I can't make the rent. You have no cash. There's one rule. Put the other guy down. Just calm down. I'm calm, man. I'm calm. You calm down. Just wanna have a drink. Why'd you come out alone? You looking for trouble? What happened? Bad boy jumped on a movie star. What about you? Nobody knows who I am. A man distracted is a man defeated. It's an invitation from Chet Frank. You train people to fight. I train people to prevail. Tell them your training method. The fighters before a fight. Three marbles. Each fighter has a two and three odds of choosing the white marble. White marble's a pass. What if he picks the black marble? Black marble's a handicap. Who imposes the terms of the battle will impose the terms of the peace. Each fighter will pick a marble. Should he pick a white marble, he'll be given a pass. You draw the black marble, you're either going to have one arm tied to your body or potentially both arms tied to your body. You stole my idea. You can't copyright an idea. He has a document of his training regime that he's used for many years. You want to make some money? Fight on the undercar. It's worth a quarter of a mil. The competition is weakening. What about the fighter's family? What do they eat? The fight is fixed. We pick who gets the white marble. Who gets the pass tonight? You. I'm ending the charade. Mr. Flair, I need to talk to you! You think you're going to the ring? You're going nowhere, Mike. You're going nowhere. There is no situation you could not escape. You know the escape. 